Well, in the last Jasmine video, I told you a little bit about what I was expecting from Jasmine's price, and we went over some of the structural analysis to get an idea of what Jasmine's price is doing in the grand scheme of things. And in today's video, I want to tell you exactly what the three different buy zones that I have are, so you know exactly when I'm planning on buying some more Jasmine, adding it to my portfolio. And so with that said, let's not waste any more time at all, and let's get straight into the video. Now, looking at Jasmine again, as I mentioned before, in the last video, I told you all that I was watching very closely what was happening with this range of 618 to 786 Fibonacci zones to the bottom side and the range of 618 to 786 Fibonacci zones to the top side. Well, what we can see is that over the last day or so, Jasmine has really started to venture down into this bottom side 618 to 786 zone. And so what I want to do is I want to tell you exactly where I am buying and what I think is going to happen if we do keep hitting these different zones. So this will probably be a rather quick video, but it's all good. Let's get into it. So looking at Jasmine here, as I mentioned before, the first major zone that we talked about in the last video was right here at the 786 level. Considering the fact that we have seen support hold up here before, I am going to go and say that this is still an extremely strong level of support. And I am going to be establishing my very first buy, buy zone sitting right here at 0.10 or 0 0.0169. So basically 0 0.017. This is where I am expecting personally that we could get a bounce from Jasmine's price back towards the upside. And so because of that, I do want to establish this as one of my buying zones. Now, if the price of Jasmine does clear below 0 0.0169, what I am expecting is that we will look for a continuation to the range low here. And the range low is currently sitting right here, right back around this 0.15 level. So that would serve as my second breakdown target, or that would serve as to where I think not only the price would go, but where I'd be looking to buy. So it might look something like this, right? Boom. Something like that. Now, the third target that I would have for Jasmine is that if we do lose both of these, which I do think it would be rather difficult for Jasmine to just absolutely smash through both of them without some type of bounce to the upside. But say hypothetically it does happen, I would be looking for a Fibonacci 1.618 Fib extension or even just a 1.272 Fib extension right now towards the downside, which is based off of, of course, our swing low to swing high. So that puts us right here, right around 0 0.0128 for our third buying target. This is where I'd be looking to buy it. So in general, I'm under the belief that Jasmine could find some support, some support off of any one of these. But as we lose each one, the likelihood of a continuation back down to the next one gets even higher. So we could bounce off of the 0 0.017 mark. If that doesn't happen, I think we're going to 0.149 or 0.15. If we do lose that one and, you know, we don't get a bounce, which I think we would, then I think we're going down to the 0.128 level here. And of course, I would personally be looking to buy on each one of these zones as I am in the long term, in the grand scheme of things, extremely bullish on Jasmine and what it's future does hold. And so as I mentioned before in the last video, there is no guarantee that we do get the break to the downside of this range. But considering that's where we are right now, considering the fact that we're making our way to the downside, I think it is important to have these little limit orders set and be prepared to, you know, exactly when you want to start doing some purchasing. So you're not trying to just react to whatever the market's giving you. You're actively getting involved. You're actually putting a strategy in place and you're actively getting ready for whatever does come your way. And so these are the three zones where I am going to be planning on buying up some Jasmine. And of course, the price could go lower than that, but I'm not really expecting it to. I think we're going to find some support on at least one of these. And of course, that will have served as a beautiful buying opportunity. Now, speaking of some other beautiful buying opportunities, guys, don't forget that we do have the free trading group down below. This is a place in which you can join completely for free. There's a couple things that you need to do, which I'll talk about in a second. But if you do join it, you will be able to get access to live trading sessions. You'll be able to get access to signals from tr pro traders who are telling you on a daily basis the short trades are opening the long trades they're opening, the money that they're making, giving different tutorials on how to trade and much more. And again, it's literally all for free. All you need to do is actually go to the link down in the description below. There will be a coin W link down there and I'll actually get this pulled up. There'll be a coin W link down there. If you do use my link and deposit, you can win up to $30,000 in bonuses. You don't need a KYC, meaning you don't need to give them any personal information. And you also don't need a VPN. You can just deposit funds, start trading, earn up to $30,000 and get access to our free trade group so make sure that you do go check that out because the guys in here make real 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 money and it's absolutely beautiful to watch and so overall that's my strategy that's my game plan a quick update here on jasmine three buy targets put in at this point 0 0.0169 0 0.0149 0 0.0128 if jasmine's price does start losing support these are the levels that i'm buying at expecting some returns off of them and i can't wait to update you if that does happen so thank you guys of course for tuning into a quick little ta session 
letting you guys know what on my plans. If you do like these videos where it's just real quick, I tell you what my plan is for certain cryptos, please do let me know down in the comments below. I can probably do this like every day or every other day. Very easy, very simple to make. So I'd love to continue it if you'd love to see it. So I do, of course, appreciate you all for watching this video. Subscribe to the channel if you did enjoy it. And I can't wait to see you all next time. Peace out, everybody.